All right, what's going on, you fam? Ryu Din here. Vegeta Zenkai is now in game. So we're going to go ahead and take a look at the character. I really like this art. I like the contrast, the colors. But anyways, we've got him fully maxed out here. So here's the boy at 1,400%. As we discussed before, very good stats. His kit, uh, a bit, a little bit controversial just because there's no way to nullify endurance. And there is no way for him to deal with pesky cover cuts, which is part of the reason why he fell off from being such a dominant force but uh with the green card his ultimate his stats the zenkai ability all these things put together maybe vegeta will look very very impressive and that we're all wrong as i discussed in the breakdown this is the team we're going to be using beerus of course because revival nullification as well as being another strike z ability uh god key unit goku vegeta because they're one of the best units in the game Ultra Gogeta for the Z ability, Red Goku for the max HP, because Vegeta, for some reason, has a very, very good uh, defensive aspect to him. Type neutral, 40% reduced damage received, paired alongside the 20% when he shows up, and the sub count, and the type neutral, and some also giving blast attack defense, plus the, Z, uh, the Zenkai ability for Goku Vegeta. Now, in terms of the equipment for Vegeta, I went ahead and gave him this right here. This Awakened Equip is giving him a significant amount of strike attack. His Platinum Equipment, Absolute Forte, giving him 7% to strike and blast attack pure per God Key Battle Member. And this right here is going to be giving him blast defense, blast attack, and pure strike attack if he's fighting with another God Key Battle Member. We really want to build up that strike. So enough about that. Ship it to some PvP. All right, here we go. USS team. Let's go ahead and start with Goku Vegeta. Part of the reason why I like this setup is just because we also have one extra strike versus their blast, which is very useful. Vegeta? Hello, Topo. Hello, Jiren. Let's ramp up our damage here. Is that two cost to my green? Wow, you went right away. No, right, we're doing a decent job tanking. That's a negative. Whoa, let's go Vegeta with that strike attack buff. Holy crap. Whoa, Vegeta ramping up significantly. Go to Beerus. What the hell? Two green cards, really? I'm just gonna go right away. Nope. Do this. Go right away. Vegeta really ramped up quick there. I don't know if you guys noticed, but... Uh, he went kind of crazy with his damage, no? Oh, crap. I think he's dead. It's okay. Vegeta did his job. I think it's fair to say that Vegeta did his job there. I was very happy with the damage output in the end. Nice. Two cards, thank you. Nice, well played. That's a rush, that's no issue. Ultimately, we'll let Beerus take whatever hit he has for us. Oh no, the blue card, he killed it! One thing I wanted to keep in mind is the fact that Jiren has... No, he doesn't have uh, insurance, actually. I haven't used the rush yet. Cool. Ah, oh, Beerus, very clutch. Except it wasn't enough. Why did he not go right away that time? Whoops. Oh, there's a rush. Good job, Jiren. Good job indeed, Jiren. Let's just go for the tackle and then wrap this one up. Let me jump in for the next one. Yeah. 
All right, match two. God key. This is where I was worried about Vegeta. Look at all these different cover change units. Zamasu, Zamasu, God Vegeta, Super Saiyan Blue Evolve Vegeta, Goku Vegeta. Five cover change units. This poor guy, we're gonna have to drop combo again. All right, this doesn't look too bad. We're more strike oriented than blast regardless, so. And we don't need to deal with the uh, yellow Vegeta shenanigans too much. Up to green as well. Just in case he sidesteps. There we go. Let's go, buddy. Remember, he's all about that strike damage, so that's what we want to build up here. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. Alright, got you there. I think that's enough to kill. The, uh, the damage buff Vegeta's providing us is very helpful as well. He's not just a standard fighter. Supporting us as well is a big deal. Varus. Alright, Vegeta, I want to see... Can you... Ah, well, we'll never know now. I wonder what this is. A couple Super Saiyans. Ooh, baby. Oh, I see what he's doing. Zenkai buffed baby and oob and fat boost with some super tanky units. For Vegeta to pummel. Let's go. Alright, Vladimir. I don't really know what you cooked up here, but... Uh, looks like all good fun. You want to give Vegeta the screen card? Right away. Sure. Crap. Gotcha there. Oh, is Baby dead? <laughs> I think Baby might be dead. Talk about a damage ramp up. Jesus. Thanks for the support buffs. Good old Vegeta. Ah, crap. Alright, let's see now. Remember, Vegeta's sub count is dropping down as he does all this. I see the tankiness. Nice. Look at that. So we're gonna pop a green card, see if we can catch him in the sidestep. Oh, he just goes right away, huh? Yeah, he really just goes right away. Got a Beerus. Let's see. I don't want to waste all these green cards. Nice. Alright, let's see what happens if I do this. And then pop the main. Wait for the side slip. Oh, Jesus. Oh, then, sir. That was kind of scary. That was absolutely terrifying. Alright, come on, Vegeta. We need you to punch right through this guy's defenses. Alright, let's just go for it. Pretty good damage, not gonna lie. Is that good old healing for Fapu? There we go. Get him out of here. God damn it. This guy heals a percentage of the damage he takes. Alright. Let's do this. That not being enough is a little bit sad for me. Alright, there we go. I was just a little bit sad that we couldn't finish him right there. But that's where 35% strike damage made the big difference. We used the blast card. I think if we, if we had a strike card that we would have been able to finish pesky little oop.
Fight the team. Uh, a lot of strike ceiling. A lot of pain in general. Oh, ooh, goodbye. All right, powerful opponent. Not too many cover changes to have to worry about. Just blast-oriented ones. That's not good. Let me get that type neutral. And they never mentioned that it was uh, not stackable. But it, it looks like it only happens once. It must have been the translation miss. You gonna stick around, so that's fine. I got a gift for you. Not sure there. What are you guys with the drop or the attempt at one? Nice. And we're gonna pop the main too. We're gonna slice it. There we go, because I'm scared of blast armor. Nah, this isn't good. Nice, do that. Alright, goodbye. Two green cards, too. You cannot ask for a better set of stuff time cards. Got you with this. Oh, I could have got him if I went for one more side slip too. You're yeah, right, Vegeta. We got you. Do this. Oh, wow, nice. And then pump your main, maybe a tackle. Strike card. Die, Pivita, stand. Come on, Beerus. I guess we'll just wait for when he goes for the rush. Considering this guy's got his gauge going. See, you think you've taken care of all my key. But I got plenty. Ah, uh, maybe not. Jesus, the lag is definitely something else here. There we go. Alright, Frieza, what's the plan, buddy? Go for this. You got a blue card. Nice. Get him, Beerus. Go for tackle, maybe? Yeah, I got plenty of strike cards for you. Good old Beerus. Alright, final match. Coming up against the Fusion Warrior team. So, Vegeta. Pretty good. Uh, his strike damage is good. Last damage is obviously not the same considering he doesn't have that 35%, but still good. Um, he needs to ramp up a little bit, but the Zenkai ability with his high stats and, you know, the minimal amounts of percent damage dealt uh, are carrying him here, so he's good. We'll have to try him out some more, but he's not mid. He's good. I'm curious to see if Vegeta can one-shot Ultra Vegeta. That would be a trip. There he is. If only this green card was going to deal with his uh, inability to deal with cover changes. This. Nice. 
You're gonna have to switch. I'm gonna wait for him to switch first. Oh, actually, I can just kill Ultra Gogeta here. Why don't I just do that? I may as well just do that. There's no reason not to. Right away. Got you there. Go for this. Oh. Go for that. Probably should have ramped them up a little bit here, but it's fine. I think he'll do enough. Cool. I'll pop the main. If he goes for anything, at least I have a bajillion cards, surely, to deal with him. But if I get a blue and a green card, I'm gonna cry. Let us see. There we go. Did they, wait a minute, did they add that shaking effect to this? Did, it, did his LF always have that towards the end? I don't remember. But either way, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to leave a like if you did. Consider subscribing too. Don't forget to check out the second channel and the Twitch. And until next time, you guys take care of yourselves. Peace.